So this lesson wants us to take a, an array of flavors and an array of toppings and then loop through all the different flavors and all the different toppings and make a list of all the different combinations that you can have and we're supposed to return that as an array list. So a couple things. First of all, we're going to create an array list of strings and I'm going to call mine combos and that's going to be new array list of string like that. I'm also going to have a variable called this combo which I'm going to use later on. Right now I'm just going to make that to the empty string. And then we're going to do a nested loop which we saw in a previous piece of lesson 7. Um, the outer loop is going to be i going from 0 to the size of the flavors string. So that's flavors.length. And the inner loop is going to be a different variable. We can call it j. And that's going to go from 0 up to however many toppings there are. So that would be toppings.length. And then I'm going to try to do the formatting like they put over here. So this particular combo, I want to equal the flavor that we're currently on, which would be flavor subscript i. And then I need to say the word with, with a couple spaces on either side. So something like this. And then I need the current topping that we're on, like sprinkles over here. So that would be toppings item J. And then I need to say this little phrase here on top. So the first time through the loop, it would say something like chocolate with sprinkles on top and then the next time they'll do the loop chocolate with something else on top and then chocolate with something else on top until we were done with all the toppings and then it would go to the next flavor like vanilla with sprinkles on top and so on. So then this combo we're going to add to the array list. So my array list is called combos. So all we have to do is say combos.add this combo. And then when we're done going through the loop, I forgot a little brace there. This should be kind of like that. And then when we're done going through that double loop, we now have an array list called combos, and we're going to return that array list. So if this is all run smoothly, Okay, so we have flavors plural somewhere and flavors singular somewhere. That's got to be flavors plural. Let's check this again. And there we go. 